Hey, what's going on everyone? I'm Jeff Bacalar from CNET.com. We're here live at CES 2011. I'm here with the Nintendo 3DS. It's our first look at the device. It comes out in March. We don't have a price yet, but it is the successor to the Nintendo DSi and the Nintendo DS Lite. It does 3D gaming. If you notice, the top screen here displays a 3D image without the need for 3D glasses. Pretty incredible. Below is a standard touch screen. On the back, two camera lenses allow you to take 3D photographs, which is really cool. Talking more about the 3D screen, it has a 3D slide adjuster, so you can customize the 3D effect. You can make it more intense or even eliminate it altogether. It's backwards compatible with Nintendo DS games, which is really cool, so you can play those old games. And it's going to be do some, doing something called Street Pass, which allows this to communicate with other 3DSs that you pass by on the street or in your home. We don't know all the details about that yet, but we hope to find out more in mid-January. In terms of size, the 3DS is similar to what you see on the DS Lite, and it has a very nice way to it as well. Up front is a headphones port, up front also is an analog stick, and then a D-pad below that, and then the conventional four buttons that we're all used to on Nintendo portables. That's going to do it for the 3DS here at CES 2011. I'm Jeff Bacalar for CNET.com. Thanks for watching.